Today we're talking about all the Marvel rumors out there, all of our favorite rumors, all of our least favorite rumors. It's something we don't always like to do on the channel. Yeah. We try and stay away from the rumors, but we want to lean into all those Marvel yeah. rumors right now. First, we're going to talk about Deadpool 3. Yeah. Now, there's been lots of rumors and speculation about other returning mutants in That's this right. film. Deadpool is not afraid to shy away from mutants. No. Deadpool 3, we know it's going to involve some potential like time travel, universe mm -hmm. jumping kind of stuff. Hugh Jackman is definitely coming back as Wolverine for yes. Deadpool 3. We've seen it. He left his run on The Music Man yes. just to come back for this film. <laughs> uh, Stefan It's Kapikic? true, but it's still funny. Kapisic? Am I pronouncing that right? Kapisic. Evan says kind of. Uh, Stefan Kapachik, I... apologies, returning yeah. as Colossus. No, here's my question. Mm -hmm. Are we going to see Colossus non-Colossified in this? Because he's always in his... In Deadpool, right? He's always he's Colossus. always right? chromed out. That's something that happened to Colossus and probably has happened multiple times in the comics where like, he can't switch back. He's oh. Like, that's like, I think they love to do it to mutants at some yeah. point where it's like, if your mutation involves some sort of transformation, at some point you get stuck there. They're sick, the, 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 the like artists are sick of drawing you in human form. Yeah. So they're, or not, not that they're not humans. Yeah, yeah. Let me let me apologize for the problematic apologize remarks that I've to made the non about mutants, referring to them as non-humans. Mm -hmm. All mutants can be humans, They're but not all superior. humans can be mutants. Yeah, it's true. Uh, I mean, they did this to Beast all the time. First, he's a, a dude with big feet yeah. and hands, and then they get hairy, and then he takes a potion, and now he's blue and hairy. Yeah. And then he had a secondary mutation where his face is a lion, and the fur the furries went. Yeah, they went. Oh, oh. Mama Mima. Show me those human abs and that lion <laughs> face. Uh, Brianna Hildebrand and Shioli Kutsana are returning as Negasonic Teenage Warhead and Kutsana. Great. Kutsuna. That's a typo on Evan's part. I think it's... Uh, They're returning as their characters. I think it's Kristen. And then, of course, Rob Delaney is returning as human X-Force member Pete. Thank God. Thank God. Thank God they turned God. back there. However, mm -hmm. then that does make me believe all the retconned deaths that he went back and used right. the thing are real. Because Rob Delaney famously dies as all does T X Force in that in that hilarious scene. Maybe it's a flashback scene. Yeah. Maybe they regrew him. <sighs> Somehow Rob Delaney has returned. <laughs> now let's get into the rumors. Ghosts can speak. Let's the, get into the, the rumors. dead speak. The dead Rob speak. Delaney has been sending out <laughs> messages. All right, sorry. Yes, let's Here's some rumors around Deadpool 3. Okay. Yeah. Halle Berry Recently posted a photo on Instagram where she has the white hair. Whoa, the did, infamous white hair. Did story. it stay up? It stayed up. Okay, well, no, because I'm saying, no, like the, the photo. Oh, the post? I don't know if, she, if, the, if post the post got taken down. If the post goes down, mm -hmm. that rumor's coming around. Right. If the post stays up, that rumor's kind of, but She kind of posted it with like no real context. Yeah. Okay. You know, some people were saying, oh, she's promoting something else, but I don't know. She looks yeah. so much like Storm in the photo. She's going to play uh, Samuel L. Jackson's character in uh, Miss Peregrine's School for Wayward Children. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Didn't he, didn't he have, like, shocking white hair in that? I don't remember. I did not see that film. That's where they all turned into monsters. I did all not the, all see the that film. Oh, that's a good one. Eva Green. She's a babe. Uh, right? People are throwing out names left and right, though. Okay. Rumor, rumorly throwing out yes. names. Yes. Famka Jansen returning her, as Jean back. Grey. Yeah. Hello. Would love to see that. James Marsden as Cyclops. Coming He's off owed his, that from Jury Duty. Coming right? off his hot run on Jury Duty. Yeah. Could we see James Marsden come we back as Cyclops? They killed him like twice, right? Or just once. He died once and then was brought back in Days of Future Past. Days of Past. Future Past. As yeah. was... Uh, yeah. Well, we get that nice little ending in Days of yeah. Future Past. where like, this timeline, they get to be happy yes. everyone lives. Yes. Um, there and was also the rumor that Lee Schreiber will be returning as Saber. I team. know how maligned X Men's mm -hmm. Origins Wolverine. Right. I had to rest all of it because I accidentally That's okay. added rest the first thing, and I believe in the rule of threes. I know how maligned that movie is. Right. But I thought Lee F. Schreiber played he was a great. good saber tooth. He was great. I thought he was a good saber tooth, like a deconstructed saber tooth, you know? Like. They took the saber tooth from, but it was like Taylor, whatever his name is, the giant wrestler yeah, guy. Yeah, I remember from the um, from the from the original X Men movies, and they stripped it down and played an acoustic. Yeah, you know, <laughs> unplugged saber tooth unplugged. Yeah. Um, there was, but and there was like a tweet that was put out by one of these scoopers, one of these leakers, yeah. that said we would get two big appearances in this film: a returning. Two villains returning. Uh, one from like the X-Men movies. Yes. And one from the MCU. Whoa, Thanos. Malekith, the Dark Elf, <laughs> returns. 
I think Deadpool goes like, you need another chance, my guy. Chris, uh, please come into my movie and be the villain. What's the name of the Eccleston? Or, uh, no, Chris Eccleston is Malchus, but I was thinking oh. Chris, the guy, the the delightful Irish actor who was in Thor one as the guy on the date with uh, Natalie Portman. Oh, character. O'Dowd. Chris O'Dowd. Chris O'Dowd. He's coming back. He's coming back. Uh, it's always good to tell. He it was to... also in the Cloverfield Paradox. Not oh, to to that, well, wait a second. Kidding. Now everything's starting to come together. Mm-hmm. I know that was another movie. But do you, is it a, a good joke strategy to just act completely clueless about the name of the actor that is the punchline of your joke and then force you, your your to say for your, your co-host to name the actor for you? Because if that's true, <laughs> call me Johnny Carson. <laughs> that was a long way for a ham sandwich. Uh, who is there a villain you'd like to see return for real? For real? For yes, real? I would be satisfied with. Uh, uh, <laughs> Well, so many have come back, so I now know. I'm trying to think of I like, uh, give me a stain. A stain? Give oh, a, Obadiah stain. Give me an Obadiah that would stain. be good. Give the me guy a stain. who kicked it all off. Bring him back. Give, yeah. me, a, give me a stain. Give me my boards. We play. Make sure that my, my boards. boards are key. I mean, or, I think you saying Thanos is, is interesting because, you know, Josh Brolin has worked yes, in the Deadpool franchise as Cable. Yes. It would be great to see him come back as Thanos. Yeah, why not? Why not? I say bring the Green Lantern back in for this one. Yeah. Um, before we go on to our next rumory topic, let's see what the folks out there in the chat are saying. Oh, we're not gonna put those in. Much. But before we do that, <laughs> yeah, why don't we shout out our friends at Nerd Ride? Let's do it. Our friends and merch partners who make every day just a little bit better mm-hmm. for us. Mm-hmm. Uh, you can see they've got Brandon. a hotline. I'll sit. They got a hotline of some yeah. into the Spider Verse merch. And Ooh I wore la. mine because I was so Ooh excited. I wore mine already, and now it's in the wash. They got a ghost. They got this ghost spider. You know, yeah. uh, Gwen. They got a you know a regular Miles inspired there's one. A, there's uh, a there's a Miguel incursion, a, an incursion of logos. Right, right. I love all very that nice. Stuff. They yeah, have yeah. five Spider Verse inspired shirts. On their site, with a spider person for every mood. That's true. You can bring out your inner spider punk oh, with yeah. the web shred Z. Show off how tangled up you are with spiders weave tea or kick up your heels with a portal dance tee. Shopping at Nerd Riot is one of the best and only ways to support our channel besides written mail telling me how much you like it. <laughs> and in addition to our Guardians of the Galaxy merch, you can find so much merch inspired by the MCU, Star Wars, DC, Spider-Verse, all your favorite fandoms, Delicious. except Doctor Who, because screw them. <laughs> oh, Keep your no. scroll detectors on high alert with our upcoming Secret Invasion line. Some really cool Indiana Jones and Barbie-inspired oh, oh. designs dropping soon. Oh, man. Now, join the... You can go ahead. I would never encourage anyone to join a riot. <laughs> go Contrary to, to riot what the January 6th report says, oh, my I have never actively recruited people to join a riot. I've only suggested a camping trip to D.C., to fight for freedom may not be the bad idea you think it is. All right, Sarah Hachidorian, do you think we'll see any other cameos in Deadpool 3? What cameos do you want to see? I mean, you made those mentions already. Mm-hmm. You know, if you bring back Storm, I say bring back Toad. You know, I'd love to see a lot of X-Men from the old stuff, the old film show yes. up here. You know, Ian McKellen as Magneto would be great yes. to see. Yes. Uh, you know, or what bring about back- uh What about Emma Frost? Emma Frost. I would like Emma Frost to be redone. Oh, you know, I think January Jones is such a babe. She's a babe, but give give her more to do. Or bring yeah. back Sebastian Shaw while you're at it. Bring yeah. back the whole Hellfire Club. Well, you know, Magneto agreed with everything he said, but he killed his mother, so he had to push <laughs> a quarter through his head. It's true. It's true. Um, Which yeah. if I, you know, if I had a dime for every time I pushed a quarter through a guy's head, I'd have, <laughs> I'd have, I'd have, I'd have, you have 30, no quarters I'd have 35 cents. 